Hello and welcome. This is going to be a seven video series for live TV streaming. And this is my first YouTube series, so I'm not used to doing videos, so I apologize. Hopefully uh, it comes out okay. I'll also not be cutting out any issues I might come up to. Uh, I've seen a lot of YouTube videos when I'll go through. I'll watch how they set everything up. When I go to do it, I have nothing but issues and I don't know how to work around it, so I'll leave them in too. I tried this in one video, it came out to be really long, and I figured, you know what, let me break it up into seven pieces so you can choose what section you'd like to go to, so that might help out too. I spent a good time on YouTube watching the videos and replying, and one, uh, one user actually asked me if I could actually help out by doing a, a video, so that's why I'm going to go ahead and do this. I originally set this up when I started playing around with this on a lot of computers and the issue with that is you end up with computers all over and you do get it working so I'm gonna do all this on one machine <clears throat> um, so basically I had I also had this working on a Windows 7 box running Windows Media Center which is awesome the live TV features great recording TV shows series episodes it's, it was really nice but it's end of life so I sat back and said okay I have everything working now I need to go and get rid of Windows 7 I want to go to Windows 10 so with that what, what I have here I'll show you now so I have a i5 2400 with 16 gig of RAM running Windows 10 Pro and this is it. There's not much else to the hardware. It is running a ATI Radeon 7450 HD card. Uh, the hard drive, I believe, let's take a look. Well, uh, let's see. So I have a 500 gig hard drive. Not a big deal because we're going to move files around. I'm going to store everything on another machine where I keep all my other stuff. So, the, so basically, it's going to be Windows 10. I'm using the HD Home Run Prime with the with a cable card for live TV streaming. For that, there's there's a few different ways of getting live TV. One is through Plex, which also I'm going to use to organize my movies, my TV recordings, and whatnot. It will have a TV guide. You also have Next PVR, which is what I'm going to use versus Windows 7 Media Center. I'm going to use MCE Buddy to cut commercials, rename files, convert, and do the moving for me. Uh, now, Next PVR and HD Home Run, they have their own software. It works great. Kodi uh, is a really nice interface also, which also has Next PVR support, and I kind of like that also. So, <clears throat> so you'll be able to watch TV different ways. Um, one of the other nice reasons why I'm going to do set up Kodi is also eventually for 50 bucks you can get an Android device with a remote. You can put it on a TV and you can stream that way. So I'm streaming to uh, Microsoft. Uh, Xbox One, an Xbox 360, two Roku streaming sticks, uh, a iPad, iPhone, a Windows uh, Windows 10, Surface Pro 2, laptops, and my Galaxy Note 3. So you can use this on a lot of devices. It's really, really handy. Well, well I know this video is very boring, so sorry about it. There's not much really to tell here. Hopefully this comes out handy. I hope you like what's going on. Here's hopefully how I'm going to do the next episodes. So this one is the hardware and a quick overview. The second one will be setting up a HD home run. Um, I'm going to count on you already have it plugged in in the network and whatnot. I'm just going to install the software, launch it so you can see it. Uh, it was challenging calling. I have Xfinity, Comcast. It was challenging getting the cable card configured and recognized by them, but once I did, it's up and running. and I really like it. I'm going to do installing Plex, setting up the movies, and that. That's just it there. Then we'll step on to the live TV portion with the HD Home Run, which will do TV Guide, 
and favorites and how to do the icons for ABC, CBS, whatnot, the resizing and getting that looking nice. Then we'll jump to next PVR. Cody with the next PVR and MCE Buddy. And hopefully by the time we get all this done, this one machine will be able to do everything for me that the other five machines I have in the house are doing. And I can shut them all down and let this one handle it. So please stay tuned for the next one, which will be the HD Home Run. Thank you.